Alright, ladies and gentlemen, uh, we're going to go over some of the stuff that's happened for the past few days. Since the last time I made one of these videos, um, we got the 100 Thieves uh, Halo merch. Um, I really do like the water bottle. It looks pretty cool. Um, the hat is okay. Um, I probably... I'd probably say I would rock like this sweater maybe and like the shirt, but it's all right. I like it. Um, moving on, uh, we have SSG Ubernix saying nine out of five out of ten. As I'm recording this video, I'm installing the the Halo Infinite update. Hopefully, you guys updated it by the time this video is out and you guys are enjoying the campaign. Um, but a lot of people keep saying like 9 out of 10, like really good campaign, so looking forward to see what that's like. Um, Ace said on his stream that he was the original 4th before his snipe down, and they also were almost signed by G2 Esports, so let's just watch the video. It's uh, Boo Boo. He actually took my spot. It's Boo Boo, Fowl, and Bound. I was teaming with them. We almost signed. Here's a little fucking behind the scenes. We almost signed with G2. <laughs> Me, Boo Boo, Fowl, and Bound. And then, oh, we almost signed. Or, like, we were talking to them, and then they dropped me. So that's really interesting. So they dropped Ace. And they were going to sign with G2 Esports, which they have a different roster. And now I guess they're with FaZe, so that's pretty interesting. Um, here's another thing with the customization. Uh, lethal Frustrated. Um, honestly, I know the customization Halo Infinite is a mess completely, and we can all agree to that. But the fact that I can't put on a kill effect while using my own team's BR skin is just something next level stupid. Which I think is, uh, yeah. I agree. Pretty dumb. Uh, moving on. We have Zach Morris here. I can finally tweet this out. Excited for the future. So he's being signed. He's a former coach or whatever. So I wonder where he's going to be signed to. Um, here's a show match of Lulu and Team Ace. Um, this will be on Friday, December 10th, uh, it'll be just a bunch of creators, and, yeah, it'll be a big show match, so if you guys want to tune into that, it is what it is. Moving on, um, Valorant Pro, slash, used to be Pro on CSGO, Nitro, um, He's transferring from 100 Thieves to play Halo or something. I don't know what it is, but he said he just wanted to play in the open events. So there's that. <laughs> Moving on. Um, here it is. We have Envor, Super CC, Skeptify, Joey Ho, and Mikrin. They're all being signed by someone, um, probably going to be announced probably within a few days. Uh, looking forward to see what organization joins them, because they're a pretty solid team. I think they'll probably place like top 24 or top 20 out of like 300, whatever, 400 teams, which is pretty good. Uh, moving on, we have this Halo series, Gear Up Spartans, we'll see you at the Game Rewards, so uh, tomorrow... Um, we're going to see probably like some like Halo series kind of movie thing uh, be happening in 2022 that we saw with the Master Chief. So we're going to see our first trailer. So it's going to look pretty badass. Moving on. Uh, Gully Designs here. He made a cool little thing um, to see what your rank would be for like top 1000. Um looks pretty cool pretty badass reminds me of like the apex ranking system when you're like the top 1000 
um really really cool something to grind for um moving on uh forerunner gg if you guys want like a lot of new stuff and article wise um moses fps i think it is he helps with all the stats and stuff with all this kind of stuff um i'll put a link in the description down below for you guys to check it out um but there's a lot of cool um things in here um they ranked the teams by the stats um optic gaming number one sentinels two cloud nine three heat united four inconceivable which is phase clan five kansas city pioneer six space station gaming seven G2 Esports is 8th, Gamers First 9th, and then honorable mentions we have Oxygen, Xset, and then Cartel as the European squad. So I'll put a link in the description down below. Um, here's a nice fun little flag run here. I literally went across the map with ease. Pretty cool thing there. Um, insta installation install like sizes. Show you guys what it is there. Um, C9 Renegade. Let's take a look at this. Alright, we gotta rewind to this. It was freezing up. Get that overkill. Good shit. Pretty badass, uh, two overkills in scrim, so that's like, those overkills were against top of the competition, so that's very hard to do, so congrats on him on doing that. Um, we got some exclusive, um, skins, uh, if you buy anything that's Halo gear merchandise, you will be given a code of this mongoose skin. Uh, I'll put a link in the description down below for you guys. Um, moving on. <laughs> Here's a little jump that this guy figured out thanks to a shyway tips. So he just does a little super jump and made it there. Um, yeah, I already have that. So Fnatic tweets out, it's almost time Spartans who's headed to Zeta at Halo later today. Um, they're just trying to make some tweets because the game is officially being released today. So hopefully they will, you know, announce the actual roster within the next few days. Um, <laughs> look at that. All Valorant shit. Um, moving on, Boom TV. Um, <clears throat> they picked a winner for the bounty, uh, for the most bounty or whatever. They had a little thing during this tournament, and Ace won it for his best no scope. <coughs> so as you could see, pretty amazing clip. Like he got four kills. Pretty cool. He did it in a little tournament thing there, and. Gonna move on to the rosters here. Um, anything new that I had in here? Nothing new. Yeah, nothing new. Just the Chiefs joining in in the Halo scene, which we already know. And this team I'm gonna be signed by a new organization. I already know about Mental Solar's Explosive. Um, another Gears team, we probably could see his Demise, TJ, Noe, and Tidy, and then Icy Clutches, Kenny, and Precision. So those guys could be potentially uh, competing in Halo as well. Then we have this Nicey, Rami, Nick, 
Nikuski and Cullet. Cullet is a pro player from Paladins and also from Rogue Company. But um, there's that. Then you have um, Merkage, Tilligent, Fnatic, and I guess they're in a search for a third. And for other AMs, not too sure about, but that's all I know. So hope you guys enjoy uh, everything there. And uh, yeah, take care, enjoy the campaign, and uh, peace.